Oh Lord, forgive me, Lord Jesus. Oh man, I just woke up. I'm a little late. Running late. We gonna do a reading out loud. Uh, reading out loud. I can't even talk right now. Let's forgive me, y'all. Uh, it's it's twelve forty-five. I'm supposed to be done. I'm supposed to be doing this at twelve fifteen. Grandma, don't kick me behind, please don't. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, good night, wherever you at. All them time zones connect back to the one from the Most High. Amen. Yeah. You say God is a wonderful Creator. Amen. A wonderful Creator. Cookie. Glory be to God. Amen. I got a little headache, so I was trying to sleep that up. I looked at the time. It said 11. I mean, it said 12. It said 1234. And then, and then I looked. I'm like, oh, snap. Yeah, man. We're going to get into it and read it out loud. Proverbs chapter 17. Yeah, Proverbs chapter 17. Let's get into it. Glory be to God. Thank you for these words. Does your body good? Getting hot out here. Yeah. Here we go. I'm so sorry, y'all. Forgive me. Forgive me. Thank you, Lord. Heavenly Father. Dear Heavenly Father. Thank you for waking us up again. One more time. To glorify, worship, praise your holy name. We come to you humbly but boldly. Like little children. Seeking your faith. And what to do with our free will that you bless us with in your grace. That's sufficient for everything needed to do to glorify you in your grace. We ask that you teach us, guide us, lead us, and direct us in all your truth. And we pray that the listener and the viewer will be healed quickly, swiftly, strengthened, encouraged, motivated, inspired. Uplifted in their spirits, so that we may attack all the evil and wicked thoughts and the demonic oppression, depression, trying to hold them down. We tell the devil he is a liar. He has no place, memorial, stay, or do anywhere near your children, your innocent children. And those who are guilty of sin because they don't know you, may through this prayer, they be covered by your blood of Jesus Christ who was beaten, crucified, hung up on a tree, so that we may have eternal life after being rose from the dead three days later, Lord. Your miracles after miracles will not go unnoticed, unappreciated. We give you all the praise with every breath, with every heartbeat, with every organ functioning of this body. Please be a doctor. Be uplifted. Be glorified, Father. And we thank you for those who are out here lost, not understanding what's going on. May this prayer redirect their attention back to you, Lord. God, Father, Abba, Almighty Creator, wonderful counselor. Please, Lord, humble ourselves so that we may be in position to save others who need to be saved. That no one will perish and that we will all come to repentance with a sincere, genuine heart out of an authenticity of, of growing love for you. Our, our Heavenly Father who does everything for us, may we reciprocate it by being obedient to your word and your will. And we pray that every word we're blessed to read, spoken, 
heard that it would hit the listener and that place needed to hear and that they would be encouraged, strengthened to understand that you are a holy God, not just a God, a holy God who loves us enough to give us opportunity to glorify his holy name. And I pray that every word read that the listener would be encouraged, nothing less, and that you would be glorified, and that heaven on earth will be clear and visible to those who need to run to it and cling to it and be about it. In Jesus' name, we thank you, Lord Jesus. Amen. Thank God. Amen again. Thank you, sir. Forgive me for being late, y'all. Right, here we go. We reading out loud Proverbs chapter 17. Amen again. Um, it starts with the title, Moral, comma, Ethical, comma, and Spiritual Priesthood. Close parenthesis. Continue. We got to kind of hurry. I ain't got a lot of battery. I ain't charged my battery right. Verse 1. Better is a dry moisture, comma, and quietness therewith, comma, than a house full of sacrifices with strife, period. Woo, that deep. Verse 1 again. Better is a dry morsel, comma, and quietness therewith, comma, than a house full of sacrifices with strife, period. Verse 2. A wise servant shall have rule over his son that causes change. Comrade, and shall have part of the inheritance among the brethren. Period. Verse 3. The finding pot is for silver, comrade, and the furnace for gold, color. But the Lord tried the hearts. Period. Verse 4. A wicked doer giveth heed to the first lip. To me, color. And a liar giveth ear to a naughty tongue. Period. Verse 5. Whoso mocketh the poor reproaches his maker. Colon. And he that is glad at calamity shall not be unpunished. Period. Verse 6. Children, children are the crown of old men. Semicolon. And the glory of children are their fathers. Period. Verse 7. Excellent speech becometh not a fool, curling, much less do lying lips a prince, period. Verse 8. A gift is as a precious stone in the eyes of him that hath it, curling, whithersoever it turneth, comma, it prospereth, period. Verse 9. He that covereth a transgression seeketh love, semicolon. But he that repeated a matter separated very friend, period. Verse 10. A reproof entereth more into a wise man than a hundred strife into a fool, period. Verse 11. An evil man seeketh only rebellion, colon. Therefore, a cruel messenger shall be sent against him. Period. Verse 12. Let a bear rob of her wealth meet a man, comma, rather than a fool in his folly. Period. Verse 13. Whoso rewarded evil for good, comma, evil shall not depart from his house. Period. Verse 14. The beginning of strife is as when one letteth our water out water, curly. Therefore, leave our contention, comma, before it be meddled with, period. Verse 15. He that justifies the wicked, comma, and he that condemneth the just, comma, even they both are abomination to the Lord, period. Verse 16. Wherefore is there a price in the hand of a fool to get with him, comma, seeing he hath no heart to it? Question mark. Verse 17. 
a fun lover at all times, comrade, and the brother is born for adversity, period. Verse 18, a man void of understanding strike his hand, comrade, and becoming surety in the presence of his friend, period. Verse 19, he loveth transgression that loveth strife, colon, and he that exalteth his gate seeketh destruction, period. Verse 20, he that hath a forward heart findeth no good, colon, and he that hath a perverse tongue falleth into mischief, period. Verse 21, he that begetteth a fool doeth it to his sorrow, calling, and the father of a fool hath no joy, period. Verse 22, a merry heart doeth good like a medicine, calling, but a broken spirit drieth the bones, period. Verse 23, a wicked man taketh the gift out of the bosom to pervert the ways of judgment, period. Verse 24, wisdom is before him that hath understanding, semicolon, but the eyes of a fool are in the end of the earth, period. Verse 25, a foolish son is a grief to his father, his father, comment, and bitterness to her that bear him. Period. Verse 26. Also to punish the just is not good, comment, nor to strike princes for equity. Period. Verse 27. He that hath knowledge spares his word, curly, and the man of understanding is of an excellent spirit. Period. Verse 28. Even a fool, comma, when he holdeth his peace, comma, is counted right, calling, and he that shutteth his lips is the thing a man of understanding, period. Wow, that's the end of Proverbs chapter 17. Amen. Glory be to God. I pray you healed. Encourage and strengthen. If you're not healed, go back and reread it till it get in there and do what it's supposed to do. Why you being obedient to it? You feel me? So, sorry for reading out loud late. Remember, 12 15 every day. Grandma time, really. <laughs> Grandma Dorothy is not playing. Man. She gave me a chance to read out loud without beating me down, okay? Y'all be, better be thankful for that, man. Yeah. It could be worse, man. And I got a little slight headaches. So, I'm praying y'all strengthen. Put the guns down. Pick the Bible up. Keep reading. Keep flying up. Don't look down. Ain't nothing down there for you, fam. I'm trying to tell y'all, man. Trying to tell you, man. Jesus is Lord. God is good all the time. And the Holy Spirit is the comforter, a washerman, a warrior. If you allow him to enter into your heart and guide you, direct you in the word, you read him. And whatever you don't understand, humble yourself and ask God to show you so you will understand why you standing under his obedience for his purpose for your life. Yeah, I got a bump back in my ear. Yeah, yeah but I love y'all. Peace. No more violence. So come together and get along. Peace is where it's at. You know you want peace and quiet in the midst of this war they trying to have. God, strive will take care of all that. So I pray you on the right side of his wrath. In Jesus' name, amen. Amen. Enjoy your day. Turkey. And another one.